Hey guys, I said I wasn't going to do any filming while I have this band-aid. I will link my video down below if you want to know all about it. Um, but I had totally forgotten, but my fortune cookie soap winter box came in the mail today. So I had to open it. So I had to film a video because I like to do the open box for you guys. So I wasn't planning on filming, but I literally just came in from checking the mail and I was like, let me just sit down and film real fast. So this is the um, winter box. And I will say I almost canceled this recently because I was like, Oh, I have so many Bath and Body products. I need to use some up. But I just couldn't because I love getting it. You get it four times a year. I'll have all the info down below. And it's just a fun surprise. And this year it says it's Old Fashioned Family Christmas. Jelly of the Month Club official member. Um, what is that? The National Lampoons. I don't, I've never watched those movies. Um, I think it's like supposed to be like that. And the winter launch party is November 12th at 6.30 Central Time. And, you know, as usual, they give you a $10 off code. I'm really excited. I'm really excited. Okay. Ooh, for, the first thing I see is something I'm really excited about. Let me see if I can find it. I bet this is it. Moose Mug Cuticle Butter. Can I refill your eggnog? Rich cream egg and a touch of nutmeg. I'm thinking this is it. I got a cuticle butter in one of the other boxes before. Mmm, I love winter scents and holiday scents. This smells amazing. It smells better than regular eggnog. Mmm. And their cuticle butters are really nice. And it lasts. I mean, it's a tiny jar, but it's going to last so long. Okay. They always give you an OCD hand sanitizer, which is just their version of, you know, um, Germex. This is Malak Kalikimako. Do you see that? <laughs> okay. With visions of swimming pools dancing in your head, tropical spice rum, Tahitian vanilla sprinkled with jasmine petals and twisted woods. Ooh, that sounds like it should smell really nice. It's kind of hard to tell because, um, you know how sanitizers have all that alcohol in it. So at first sniff, that's all you smell. And I have to say, I'm really happy. This one is this bright blue and it does not have glitter. Some in the past have had glitter and I don't really like glitter. That's a good smell because a lot of them are really fruity and I do sometimes pass them on to my mom. Okay. Tis the season to be merry fortune cookie soup. Buy this for your wife. God rest her soul. A hint of sweet almond with warm smir swirls of tobacco. Ooh. Sometimes I do pass the soap on to my mom too. They had a mint chocolate chip one that I didn't. Right now I'm smelling... I don't smell... I'm kind of smelling almond and tobacco. I'll have to use this... Um. My lighting just changed. I'll have to use this in the bath and see if it is better that way. Okay, next up is, I think this. It says, Sparky Hydrate Me. We dedicate this to the FCS Family Christmas. Drum roll, please. Scrumptious vanilla pumpkin waffles topped with brown sugar, pecans, and sheets of fresh whipped cream. Mm. And this is just like a massage bar or like a solid lotion. Mmm, it smells so similar to the um, Bath & Body Works pumpkin waffle scent they have right now. This is so nice. I cannot wait to use this. See, I love all the holiday and wintery type scents. Okay, then there's a four different whipped creams that you can get. And I got the Bend Over and I'll Show You. I would have liked Jelly of the Month. Which is succulent strawberries, sweet vanilla sugar, sticky syrup, and a squeeze of orange. But I got this one, and it says, where do you think you're going to put a tree that big? I've got an idea. Tart cranberry, crisp pine, herbal spruce, warmed by clove, and a splash of sweet mandarin orange. Not bad. Not the scent I would have picked, but I think it will smell good. Yeah, it smells good. Um, There's a 
herby note that I hope dissipates once it dries down because I'd be a little unsure of wearing it in public. Hint, hint. But it smells good. So, okay, that's exciting. Three more things. A Pledge Allegiance Amen shower steamer. They want you to say the D Grace. A brisk and outdoorsy blend of blue spruce, balsam fir, fresh mint, and garden herbs. And these you just put at the bottom of your shower and the hot water hits it and it kind of is like a shower steam. Which I really, ooh, it's strong. I like to save these for when I'm really like congested or have a cold because it's invigorating and kind of opens up your sinuses and stuff. So I like to get one of those, especially this time of year. Fried Pussycat Whipped Soap, because who doesn't want to smell like fried pussycat? Juicy plum and whipped caramel wrapped in artisan, bourbon, vanilla, and jasmine blossoms. If this is that, um, National Lampoons, if this has, like, those references, let me know down below, because I'm kind of embarrassed that I'm not, I'm not getting any of the references. What are those nuts again? Um, I have to say, the only thing that's jumping out to me is kind of a soapy smell, so maybe in the shower I'll um, pick up more of those notes. But it does not smell bad. And then last but not least is Christmas Bonus Deep Conditioner, our third annual mystery fragrance. No hints. There's a $50 gift certificate up for grab, so email your best guesses to blah, 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 and a winner will be chosen and announced on December 22nd. Okay. Let's see. I have no idea. It smells kind of minty, like menthol-y. I don't love this scent. I'm not going to lie. I don't know. This is my first year doing the fortune cookie soap, so I don't know if their mystery fragrances are supposed to be like anything or if it's supposed to be like a known product like Vicks Vapor Rub, I don't know how they do it because they're a little quirky so it wouldn't surprise me if they picked like some known thing. It's, it's not, I don't mind it for a hair product but I wouldn't want like perfume in this. So, okay guys, that was my winter soapbox and I loved it. The cuticle butter, the hand sanitizer, the soap, the hydrate me, the shower steamer, the whip soap, the deep conditioner. I mean, all of it is really nice. So I will have all the details down below in case you are new to these videos or new to the fortune cookie soap boxes, but they are just a really nice surprise and treat. And, um, I really like to get them. So especially this was the winter one so we won't get another one till the spring and that's when they start being a little more fruity floral which I'm kind of that's not my forte so the fall and winter boxes are by far my favorites and um this was a really good one so anyways that is all and thanks for watching I'll see y'all later bye